In this video, I'm going to talk about hard drives for security systems. Let's say you have an NVR or DVR, you need to pick the correct model for them, okay? So here I have an example. It's an NVR from Samsung. You can see here, it's a Samsung one. It's not Samsung anymore. Now they changed the name. Now it's Hawa Techwin, okay? It used to be Samsung before. And now you have a hard drive here, one terabyte, Western Digital. And here you have the line. Okay, it's WD Purple Surveillance Hard Drive, okay? So, uh, Western Digital manufactures different hard drives, okay, for computers and also for security cameras. So, they're basically different. If you're buying a hard drive for your computer, your computer is going to read more than write comparing to a security system, NVR or DVR, for example. If you have a report on your computer, you're gonna read more from this report. You're like typing and putting information there, and sometimes you just save the information there, but it's not as intense as a security system. For example, a camera is like pulling video, it's pushing video to an VR or to a DVR all the time, 24 seven, for example, and it needs to be recorded there. Okay, so it's completely different. You can't use the same hard drive that you use in your computer into a DVR or an EVR, otherwise you're gonna have problems, right? So you need to pick the right one, okay? So let's take a look here on an example of a list. If you go to the manufacturer website, in this case, it's not Samsung anymore, well, as I was saying, it's Hawa now. You have a hard drive compatibility tool here. You have a recommended hard list hard drive list so you can just click here on download and you can get this pdf for example with all the information that you need here I have hard drive compatibility list as you can see i have seagate in western digital most of the time there is also samsung micron but most in uh, equipment use seagate in western digital okay so pretty good work here with Tawa that lists all the models here in the hard drive that are recommended, okay? So if you scroll down, you can see even the models that they recommend, okay? Model name here for the hard drives, okay? They test and they put the information here. If it's tested already, if it's under test, if it's not supported, pretty good job here with all the information that you need, okay? And you can also take a look sometimes inside of your DVR or NVR to see if they're using the correct model, just like I'm doing here. Here I have the model, I just opened the equipment and I can see the model here. So it's Western Digital. I have a high vision NVR here. It's also using the Western Digital model, WD Purple, okay? But um, depending on the model, if you're not, if you like can't open the model for some reason or if you don't want to, you can also check via menu if it's using the correct hard drive. Depending on the model, you can see it and some others cannot show you what uh, hard drive is inside. Let's say, for example, here with this high vision, uh, I have the NVR here. I right click on the menu and I get into a hard drive menu here and I don't have this information here, okay? I know the capacity, the status, and everything else, but there is no indication of the model that I'm using here. Even on the advanced menu, it's not there. So I don't know if I have like a Western Digital WD Purple, or if I have a Seagate, Skyhawk, for example, that's also for security cameras. The information is just not there via the menu. You have to open the device to take a look, okay? But that's okay. If you want to have your equipment working fine, you have to do this, okay? And that's all for today. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments. See you in the next video.